Hello there guys and welcome back to another lesson that's here at Jason's Guitar School. So today what we're going to be relearning is I'm yours but we're going to be adding small details to it to make it seem a little bit harder and sound a lot better and closer to the song. Okay, so the original song we learned was a G, D, E minor, C with the string pattern down, slap, up, down, up, slap, up, up, slap, up, down, up, slap, which you'll see just below me here. And if you want to learn how to play that properly, go back to the other lesson and watch that video. So today what we're going to be doing is changing that string pattern a little bit and adding in some little uh, tabs to it to make it sound more like the song or even just play it as an intro. So at the start, we're going to start with this uh, tab here for the G. So when you're in G, you start off on tree on the bottom and you pick tree and slide up to five. So that slash symbol means slide. So you hold your finger on tree, you keep the pressure on as you move along. So tree is your starting point and five is your end point. Okay, you have to keep squeezing your finger on that string if you want the sound to stay. If you remove your finger, the sound goes away. So keep squeezing for that sound. Then after the tree slide five, we have that tree on the bottom string. And then those X's in the straight line mean slap. Okay, so if you've seen the video earlier, you know how to slap properly. If you don't, watch that video. But just a quick recap, you hold your pick as if you're saying okay. And with this part of your hand here, you hit your strings. That's an easy way uh, to make the slap. So that first tab for the G is tree slide to five, tree slap. Okay, then we continue with the strumming pattern. So a lot of the arrows are taken out of the strum pattern. We go into our G chord and we start with the up down, then up slap, up pause, up slap, up down. So that's what you do for the full G. You do your tab first. And then you go into your G chord and do the full strumming. Then we are into D. So D starts off the same way, it has that 3 slash 5, but then 2. And all those X's in a straight line, slap. So that's your 3 slide 5, and then back to number 2 and slap. Go into your D chord and we continue with the strumming up down, up slap, up pause, up slap, up down. So the full D chord, that's your tab, and then the strumming. Okay, then we have the E minor chord. So on E minor, we're going from three on the B string up to five. So on that B string, pick and slide up to the five, and then it has zero. So that just means open. So you pick the B string open. So it's three, slide five, zero. And all those X's in the straight line, slap. And that's the tab for your E minor. Then you go into E minor and do your strumming. Up, down, up, slap, up, pause, up, slap, up, down. So that full E minor, that's the tab and then you strumming. Okay, and then we have C. So C, the first note on the tab for C is a zero on the B string. Very simple. And then it says zero H1, that's zero hammer on one. If you don't know how to do your hammer-ons pull-offs, go back to our earlier video and watch those. Um, but as a quick recap, it just means pick the zero and hammer your finger onto the second number, which is one in this case. So you pick zero, hammer onto one, slap. So that whole tab for the C is zero, zero, hammer one, slap. And then you go into your C chord and continue with your strumming. Up pause, up slap, up down. Okay, so that full C chord goes, that's the tab, and then you're strumming. All right, so that's a nice little intro uh, into the song. It really sounds exactly like the song. If you were to play it the whole way through, it would sound something like this. So that is it for today guys, that's your harder version of I'm Yours. So keep joining in week to week as we upload videos. We do take requests, so if you have any songs you want to learn, just let us know in comments below. And I will see you again next week.